morning. <clears throat> well, it's good morning for me. Um, it's Friday. It's actually daylight, if you can see right over there. And yeah, I can't believe I'm filming a tutorial in daylight. So I'm off work today, <clears throat> and it is like 9:37. I'm getting ready to go get a pedicure. I wanted to do, to do a tutorial with this Wet n Wild um, Color Icon palette in Pride. Um, my husband, he was so cute this morning. He brought me flowers. I thought that was sweet. Okay, I keep watching to see the tutorial. So I already have a base on, which is painterly, but I'm actually going to put a little bit of another paint pot. I'm going to use the Green Stroke um, paint pot by MAC. This is discontinued, but... Um, just like a shimmery um, green or blue would work. And in my Jumbo pencil, you can use the blue or the green. This is going all over my lid and up into my crease a little bit. I'm not putting it <clears throat> all the way up because I already have my highlight on, so I don't want that to mix. Taking that shimmery color here, and we're going to put it uh, above our crease. See how pigmented it is? You don't need that much. So I'm, I've only dipped that one time, now I'm just going to use all that product and just work it out here, blend it out. Okay, next, same brush, we're going to take the matte version of that green color and pop that right in our crease in the middle of our eye, not in the outer corner. So the most concentrated color is here, and then you're kind of blending it this way, you're not pulling it out to the outer corner, you're pulling it to the inner corner. A medium sized shadow brush and we're going to take the matte blue and start placing that in our crease. Starting at the outer corner we're just working it right right in the crease. So instead of having my brush like flat I have it tipped on so I'm using the just the top of the bristles. Okay so now we're taking the same brush but we're going to use the flat side and we're going to use the shimmery blue color. And we're placing that under our crease on the um, outer part of the lid. I'm just using my leftover product to um, what I placed in the outer. I'm just dragging it slightly in, probably about halfway in. And I'm going back with the shimmery green color, picking up it on that same blendy brush, and then I'm just going to sweep. I've left my inner corner bare, but I'm just starting right where the blue ends and where the green begins up here, I'm connecting that. So I'm making a nice um, gradient effect. So now with a clean um, blending brush, erase all your harsh lines. So um, I'll do the inner corner last, but I'm taking the clean brush from here and just buffing all those harsh lines out. So because I've used the matte color here and lots of shimmer on my lid, I'm going to go with a lighter matte color in the outer corner. So I'm going with Next to Nothing, which is, um, it's actually a frost, but it's so light and not that pigmented that it can appear um, matte, but with just a tiny bit of shimmer. I'm actually going to use the same clean blending brush. Because as I place this, I can blend it into the shimmer. So you can totally go with a black or brown eyeliner for this. But I'm actually going to go in with the colored eyeliner. This is Urban Decay Liner in Lucky. It's like a gold. Uh, I really want it to pop against this um, blue here. I think it'll look really cool. So now you can just curl your lashes and add mascara. So I aligned my tight line and my waterline with feline eye coal. Okay, so this is the final look. Um, yeah, I obviously finished getting ready. I curled my hair, and then I stuck this flower in my hair. Isn't that cute? Thanks, honey. So three things for the lips. Um, first, I put on a coat of the Sally Hansen. Um, Diamond 12 Hour, and this isn't flawless. This is like a coral, like a coral orange, really. And then on top of that, I put um, Myth, but lightly, so it's just like. And then on top of that, I put um, 
Dazzle Glass in Moth to Flame, um, just to incorporate all the gold I have on too. Here I have the e.l.f. bronzing um, as a contour, and then right here back is Prim and Proper from MAC, which is like a brownish um, blush, and then here I have my shell powder, <sighs> the hair, my shell powder here and here for kind of like my blush and my highlight and on top of that I have um, my MSF in soft and gentle which it again incorporates the gold so and then the only other thing I added to the eyes was um, I used the these two the matte blue and this shimmery blue the matte blue is here and then shimmer is just like right there to just kind of complete look because it didn't look complete so I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, tutorial and I'll talk to you soon bye it's always good to drink coffee out of a bowl, uh, <laughs> out of a cup that's as big as your face.